OK, so let's say I want to solve the inequality. 4x minus 1 over x plus 3 is greater than minus 2. So the first thing I want to do is I'm going to sketch this curve. Now this would be my preferred option. There are other ways of doing it, and one way of doing it would be to square both sides and solve the re resulting inequality. Um, I'm not going to do that, I'm going to do it the graphical method. So we've got y is equal to 4x minus 1 over x plus 3. So I can identify that it's got a vertical asymptote at x is equal to minus 3, that's when the denominator is 0. So we've got minus 3. It's going to cross the x-axis when x is 1 quarter. That's when the numerator is 0. So we're crossing at 1 quarter. There's going to be a horizontal asymptote. Dividing top and bottom by x, we get 4 minus 1 over x over 1 plus 3 over x. So when, those get, when x gets very large and positive, those fractions go to 0. And I'm just going to be left with y equals 4. So there is a horizontal asymptote of y is equal to 4. And how about where it crosses the y-axis? That's when x is 0. So when x is 0, y is equal to minus 1 over 3, so minus a third. So there's minus a third. So the curve... must be doing something like that, and therefore it must be up there for that portion of the graph, because it can't cross the x-axis to the left of minus 3. OK, so that's my curve. Now, I want to know where this is greater than the line, um, so greater than minus 2. So minus 2... is this line, y equals minus 2. So I need to determine where this curve is above minus 2. And it's above it, all of these values from that value onwards, and from this value onwards. Okay? So I need to determine this value here. I know that that's minus 3, so I know that one of the inequalities is x is less than minus 3. But I don't know that value yet. So I'm going to have to put this equal to minus 2. So 4x minus 1 uh, over x plus 3 is equal to minus 2. Multiply both sides by the x plus 3. And we'll get 4x minus 1 is equal to minus 2x minus 6. So I'm multiplying the x plus 3 by the minus 2. Add 2x to both sides. Add 1 to both sides. So 6x is minus 5. So x is equal to minus 5 sixths. So that value there is minus 5 over 6. And so the solution to the inequality is x is less than minus 3 and x is greater than minus 5 sixths. OK, so it's that portion there and that portion there. And that's how we can solve an inequality like this.